The ominous music begins, and we are mere moments away from a nightmare. And there's Dr. Eric Christopher, and right behind him, the maker of nightmares, Agony. A former CCW heavyweight champion, and an absolute nut job. Blake Chavik better keep his distance. You never know what agony is capable of or what he might do. Chilean superstar. He is put together and he is ready for agony. I talked to him earlier before the match. He's not intimidated in the least. And agony is gonna have his hands full. This individual, Taylor Wolf, is one of the strongest men pound for pound here at Coastal Championship Wrestling. Had an opportunity to speak to Taylor Wolf before Bash in the Brew 15, Dan, and he's very focused, ready to come off of that matchup he had a couple of weeks ago at our CCW anniversary show. Now he's been competing all over the world, extensive trips throughout South America. He's here at CCW, ready to give it a go. And Taylor Wolf seemingly building somewhat of a following already here in CCW. Yeah, he's incredibly powerful, Blake. I talked to him earlier as well. There he goes, right out of the gate, a drop kick to Agony. He said he's gonna be all over Agony, he's not backing down an inch. And there you see him, but Agony just a brick wall. A pair of pose lines, a pair of drop kicks, and Agony hasn't budged. As right now, Agony showing off his power, dominating Taylor Wolf. But look at the speed and quickness here of Taylor Wolf. That compact size at 220 pounds, showing off a little bit more quickness than we probably expected. Well, Agony is using his brute force. Grabbing him around the throat, just barreling him back into the corner. And again, Agony with a clothesline in the corner that time. Wolf heading to the outside, maybe looking to take a breather, but Agony's got a hold of him. Smart move by Taylor Wolf, snapping the neck down. You gotta do whatever it takes against Agony. Agony missing a punch, Taylor Wolf trying to kick out the legs. He's got him down to one knee, Blake. And Taylor Wolf, Extensive strikes here. And I think he went to the well one too many times, Dan. As Agony tried to put a stop to things, does not get the big man off his feet, but he's certainly staggered in the near side corner. Taylor Wolf now. Look at that power, just picking up Agony and dumping him right down. Just sheer strength. Covers him one, two. Not enough. And Taylor Wolf, very impressive here in his Bash at the Brew debut. The first opportunity for these fans at Hialeah to get an up close and personal look at the leader of the pack. And Agony this time, that standing Uranagi, look at him just pick up Taylor Wolf and plant him right now. Nah, you're not gonna cover Taylor Wolf like that. Blatant choke now, Blake. 
And Taylor Wolf, who is dominating throughout the first few minutes there, he calls himself the leader of the pack, Dan, with Jackal Stevens' Southeastern Championship title a bit compromised right now. Taylor Wolf could be looking to lead the pack of the Southeastern Championship division, but not if Agony is going to dominate him like this. I was just going to say he's going to have to get past Agony first. Agony just putting his foot on his chest, leaping up and dropping a leg across the chest. Taylor Wolf is in a bad way right now, Blake. As Taylor Wolf now trying to get to a vertical base, as Agony, who I thought had won over some fans here in Hialeah in recent months, seemingly reversing course here against Taylor Wolf. Agony just absorbing all of this punishment. It's and incredible. Agony goes right back to it one more time. He elevated Taylor Wolf about seven or eight feet in the air to, oh! He thought he had the match one. I think Adrian Paz's hand hit that mat a third time. But he's telling Eric Christopher it was a two count. Wolf did get his shoulder up in time. Agony, though, now going to the top plate. Wolf cutting him off. And Agony, we've seen him come off the top rope before, Dan. He's in that high red district. Wolf going up, though. And Wolf, wow, comes what all a the tremendous way superplex. This crowd coming unglued, Blake. He just superplexed Agony off the top rope and let him fly. They came separate, and Agony is down. And if he doesn't cover him, he's out of his mind. He needs to cover him. Taylor now. Wolf, but no, Wolf. it looks like he wants to add a little bit more emphasis here. He's going all the way upstairs. He's going Keep your eyes on the leader of the pack. Taylor Wolf is perched up. He goes for the 450, but he tries to put on the brakes, but he finds himself six feet under. That tombstone, he got One, all of it. Two, two three. And three. Incredibly aggressive as he had to. Did you like that, man? Did you like that? Hey, listen, man. The match man. is over. Go to the back. I don't care what you say. Come back. Go away. Go away. Eric Christopher, I gotta tell you, I don't know what his problem is with me personally, but he's always in my face. Anyway, do you want to be a mark? Or do you want to leave a mark? I'm smarter than the average bear.